How is a car dashboard assembled? Today, let us walk through the full pre-assembly process. First, the dashboard frame is mounted onto a hanging fixture. This frame supports and secures the entire dashboard. Next, the dashboard wiring harness assembly is installed. It connects the dashboard to all the electrical units in the vehicle body. Then, the air conditioning assembly is installed and secured with several bolts. Now, the power window lift module is installed. After that comes the gateway module. The gateway works like a router inside the car, making sure different systems communicate correctly and efficiently. It is fixed in place with bolts. Next is the power steering column, which helps the driver turn the steering wheel more easily. This small silver box is the in-vehicle infotainment assembly, also secured with multiple bolts. Now this simple-looking black unit is the central control module. Its main job is to manage and control various electronic systems. Next, the dashboard cover is installed, and the internal wiring connectors are pulled out to make later assembly easier. Then, the liquid crystal display instrument cluster, decorative trim panels, and the infotainment screen are installed and reinforced. The warranty booklet, maintenance guide, and user manual are placed inside the glove box and installed. Finally, the steering column cover is installed and the pre-assembly is complete. The finished dashboard assembly is sent to the main production line, where a robotic arm installs it into the vehicle body. That is how a dashboard is installed in a car. If there is anything else you want to see, let me know in the comments.